Welcome to our YouTube video. Today, we delve into the captivating world of the Copperhead Snake, Echistrodon Contortrix. Join us as we explore the detailed features, behavior, and habitat of this venomous species native to North America. From its striking copper-red coloration to its fascinating hunting techniques, we'll provide you with an in-depth look into the world of copperheads. Discover their role in the ecosystem and gain valuable insights on safety and coexistence. Get ready for an educational and captivating journey into the remarkable world of the copperhead snake. The copperhead, Echistrodon contortrix, is a venomous snake species that belongs to the family Viperidae, which also includes rattlesnakes and cottonmouths. It is native to North America and is known for its distinctive copper red or reddish brown coloration which gives it its common name. Physical Description Copperheads are medium-sized snakes, with adults typically ranging from 2 to 3 feet, 60 to 90 centimeters, in length. However, some individuals can reach lengths of up to 4 feet, 120 centimeters. They have a stout body with a relatively broad head that is distinct from the neck. The head is triangular and features a pair of heat-sensing pits located between the eye and the nostril, which aids in detecting prey. The eyes have elliptical pupils, which is a characteristic feature of pit vipers. Coloration and patterns. The copperhead's coloration can vary depending on its geographic location and age. The body is usually a copper red to reddish brown color, often with darker crossbands or hourglass-shaped markings that are wider at the sides and narrower on the back. These crossbands are typically a lighter shade of copper or tan and can be bordered by darker brown or black coloration. The head is usually a lighter shade than the body and may have a distinct copper-colored or pinkish tint. Young copperheads have a vibrant, sulfur-yellow tail tip, which is believed to function as a lure for small prey. Geographic range Copperheads are found in the eastern and central regions of North America. Their range extends from southern New England, down through the southeastern United States, and westward to parts of Texas, Oklahoma, and Missouri. They inhabit a variety of habitats, including forests, swamps, rocky hillsides, and even suburban areas. Behavior and Diet Copperheads are primarily terrestrial snakes but can climb trees and swim if necessary. They are typically nocturnal or crepuscular, active at dawn and dusk, although they may be active during the day in cooler weather or during the mating season. They are generally docile and non-aggressive but will defend themselves if threatened or cornered. When threatened, a copperhead may adopt a defensive posture by coiling its body and raising the front part, known as a S-curve. As ambush predators, copperheads lie in wait for their prey, which mainly consists of small rodents, frogs, lizards, and sometimes birds. They have a heat-sensitive organ called the pit located on each side of the head, which enables them to detect the body heat of their prey even in complete darkness. Once a suitable target is detected, the copperhead strikes quickly, injecting venom through its hollow fangs. The venom immobilize or kills the prey, allowing the snake to swallow it whole. Venom and Venomous Bite Copperheads are venomous snakes, but their venom is considered relatively mild compared to some other venomous snake species. Their venom primarily contains a mix of hemotoxins, which cause tissue damage, disrupt blood clotting, and can lead to swelling, pain, and potential necrosis at the bite site. However, Human fatalities from copperhead bites are rare, and most bites result in localized symptoms and discomfort rather than life-threatening conditions. Reproduction and Lifespan Copperheads are ovoviviparous, meaning that the females retain and develop the eggs internally, giving birth to live young. Mating typically occurs in the spring, and after a gestation period of around three to four months, the female gives birth to a litter of three to ten offspring, although larger litters have been recorded. The newborn snakes are independent from birth and are usually around 7 to 10 inches, 18 to 25 centimeters, long. Copperheads have a relatively long lifespan for a snake, with individuals living up to 18 years in the wild. However, 
The average lifespan is likely shorter due to various factors such as predation, habitat loss, and human activities. Conservation status. The copperhead is not currently considered a threatened species. While habitat destruction and human encroachment pose some threats to their populations, they are still widespread and adaptable. They are also known to occupy suburban areas, where encounters with humans may occur. Human interactions and safety. Copperheads, like all venomous snakes, should be treated with caution and respect. If you encounter a copperhead, it is important to give the snake space and avoid provoking or handling it. Most snake bites occur when individuals attempt to handle or kill the snake. If bitten by a copperhead or any other venomous snake, seeking immediate medical attention is crucial. However, it is worth noting that most copperhead bites in humans are not life-threatening and can be effectively treated with appropriate medical care, including antivenom if necessary. Overall, while copperheads are venomous, they play an important role in their ecosystems by controlling rodent populations. Understanding their behavior and maintaining a respectful distance can help ensure human and snake coexistence. Thank you for joining us on this captivating exploration of the copperhead snake. We hope you found the detailed information and insights enlightening and engaging. If you enjoyed this video and would like to see more fascinating content like this, please consider subscribing to our channel. By subscribing, you'll stay updated with our latest videos and continue to embark on educational journeys with us. Thank you once again, and we look forward to sharing more exciting content with you in the future. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and explore the wonders of nature together.